ProValue Net has been serving North Central Oklahoma, providing high speed, reliable internet service since 1996. At ProValue Net, our main purpose has always been to provide internet service to the unserved and underserved. Although we were one of the earlier internet providers for rural Oklahoma, we did not invent the internet. In 1969, ARPANET, the first computer network, was created by the U.S. Department of Defense. Dial-up internet was the first type of commercial internet service and launched in the United States in 1983. It used existing telephone lines to transmit data and it evolved to speeds of up to 56 kilobits per second. This was slow enough to make browsing the web and downloading files frustrating. In 1985, the first fixed wireless internet service was launched in the United States. Fixed wireless is a type of broadband internet access that uses radio waves to transmit data between homes and businesses and nearby wireless access points. It continues to evolve and it is now able to get up to 1 gigabit speeds with the new MM Wave technology. By 1993, the number of global internet users reached 1 million. In that same year, the first cable internet service was launched in the United States. It is another type of broadband internet service. It uses the same infrastructure as cable television to transmit data and eventually evolved enough to reach speeds of up to 1000 megabits per second. This was much faster than dial-up internet and it made browsing the web and downloading files much more enjoyable. In 1995, the first commercial DSL internet service launched in the United States. DSL internet is another type of broadband internet service. It uses existing telephone lines to transmit data and evolved to be able to reach speeds of up to 100 megabits per second. This was faster than cable internet in some areas and it was often less expensive. In 1999, the number of global DSL internet users reached 1 million. However, fixed wireless internet service is still a viable alternative to wired broadband connections such as cable and DSL in areas where these services are not available or are not reliable. Broadband connections made the internet much more accessible and affordable for the general public. In 2001, the first commercial fiber optic internet service launched in the United States. It uses glass fibers to transmit data at speeds faster than anything else available at the time. Because it was so much faster than cable internet or DSL internet, it made streaming video and online gaming possible. In 2011, the number of global fiber optic internet users reached 50 million. By 2015, the number of internet users worldwide reached 3 billion and by 2020, 4.5 billion. In recent years, there has been an ever-growing demand for even faster internet speeds. This is due to the increasing popularity of streaming videos and online gaming. To meet this demand, new technologies such as gigabit internet and 5G wireless have been developed. Gigabit internet is a type of broadband connection that can transmit data at speeds of up to 1 gigabit per second. This is 100 times faster than a typical cable internet connection. 5G wireless is a newer type of cellular network that can transmit data at speeds of up to 10 gigabits per second. This is much faster than the current 4G LTE network. At ProValueNet, we are working on creating, constructing, and implementing a fiber and fixed wireless hybrid network as quickly as we can to better serve our customers. This includes offering fiber to the home in some areas and creating a fiber backbone for our wireless internet services as a hybrid technology in other areas. You can call us at 405-624-6000, check us out online at www.provalue.net or stop by our office at 801 South Main Street, Suite 1 in downtown Stillwater.